This is Sue, by the way. Look. <laughs> anyway, what we're going to do this week is uh, we're going to put this starter switch in. So I'll, eventually, I'll actually have a key for the car as well as check all the fluids, see how they look, see where we're starting at uh, to try and get it ready to start. Um, so anyway, uh, let's do it. All right, we got it today. This is the piece I've been waiting on the mail. Well, this is the ignition switch housing. And the bezel, I believe. Yeah, this is the piece that goes inside. So this is the basically the um, tumbler for the for the lock with the new key and it goes into this housing here fits in there put that in correctly and then the bezel which is oh look it's basically this goes on top once I put the key in the bezel. We'll uh, take a look at that as soon as we get to it this weekend. I'm gonna tr go ahead and put this tumbler in now that I've got it. Just got a little excited, so I'm gonna put this into this piece here. Um, I noticed earlier that if you notice the shape of this piece right here, it's almost like a cross angle with the, this piece going with the uh, raised piece going this way and the two lump, the two bumps on the side. Well, I noticed that if you look in here, let's see if I got a flashlight. If you look in here, at the bottom, you can see that there's uh, the slot where it fits in there, but it's not at a right angle to the bumps. So what I noticed, and what I tried to do, is you can actually get a screwdriver, and you can move that a little bit and get it perfectly angled. And then this piece goes in and it fits right in and you turn it. And then so basically it doesn't come out there. So you've got your regular key, you've got your on to turn it. Then you've got your up switch where you can pull it out and then your accessory backwards, but it still doesn't come out. Uh, I saw this online as well. You use this little hole right there to get into pull it out again so that's use a little um, I used a little thumbtack here to get it out earlier just to show you guys but yeah it's all fitting together another piece that probably that goes on underneath there that I will probably try to put on here in a while but for right now I have a working key first time in several years awesome all right we're gonna try to get gas out Another thing that I can try if this doesn't work, but I figured this is worth a try. Not 
lot in there, so I think I might have to just put some gas in there. Nice little surprise. My fan is working. Electrical fan. That's good. One, two, 